All right. Um, my name is Mrs. Christabel Dachan. I'm from Nigeria, Batu State to be precise. Um, I'm the mother of um, Isabella Dachan, uh, a sickle cell patient for uh, for the past eight years. Um, she was diagnosed with sickle cell, I think, at the age of um, nine months. At nine months, and um, it, it, it has been a nightmare for the entire family because we've not had any peace during that time too. Um, when we heard of BMT transplant, bone marrow transplant, so she has had a lot of complications um, like stroke. She had stroke, I think when she was five, five years or six years old. She had uh, astromalitis at the age of seven. And then she had, um, in fact, she was on monthly blood transfusion before the BMT. She had a lot of issues. Um, she was having, um, uh, what they call it, chest syndrome, is it? Acute chest syndrome. So she was having a lot of issues. We have given up on her until when we heard of the bone marrow transplant. The father made a lot of inquiries, went to online, we read about it. So the father now said to how can he get to know uh, a good doctor that can be able to perform the transplant on her. I don't know who told him about Dr. Vikas. We went to YouTube, we searched, we saw what he has been doing. And then the father now attempted to try. So we said we are going to have a trial. And honestly speaking, they said it is a trial that can convince you. And that is exactly what we are seeing now. We brought this girl. She was just 17, I think 16 to 17 kg. We brought her. She was completely weak. We brought her. She was having issues. She was always conversing. But now, after the BMT, Dr. Vikas and the BMT team had played a very vital role in her life. As in, in the, I will even extend it to my family because once a person is sick, nobody is happy in the family. So now, if you see her, look at her. She is very, very okay. She is very, very strong. Before she cannot walk, even if you want to take her to her room, every, anywhere she's going to, you take her. But now she walks on her own. She, she, was, she was unable to carry her hands up as a result of the astromalitis uh, damage. But now she is able to carry her hands up. She moves around the house. She plays no any form of complication. Look at how chubby she is looking. We brought her. She was very, very weak. But now she is very strong. All thanks to the BNT team. Dr. Vikas is really doing a very, very good job. And my advice to anybody who is suffering from sickle cell or any form of blood disorder is to find his way straight to India and meet Dr. Vikas. He is going to do the magic. I call it a magic or a miracle. However, you're going to call it is accepted because God doesn't come down to do things with his hands. He sent people to take care of our problems. And that is the miracle we're talking about. So Dr. Vikas is one of the people that perform miracle or magic or whatever you call it in India. Here at Fortis Hospital, they are doing a very, very wonderful job in any form of blood disorder, cancer, anyone, leukemia, call it, name them, they are doing it. So I want to thank the BNT team. I want to thank all the agents that were working with us. They were really, really doing well. In fact, they really, without them, I don't even know what I would have done during admission and other things. And Alan here is always there. Dr. Garima, she's always here with us. She's always calling to know how we're doing, buying gifts, always trying to make sure that we are okay in India, always making sure we are happy. So thank you very much for your concern, for the support, for the show of love. We really appreciate We appreciate the BNT team. We appreciate Dr. Vikas for always being there. He is always ready to know what is going on and always ready to take action. Thank you very much. God bless everybody.